I'm joined by Tom Williams after this afternoon's two undefeated Dulwich Hamlet. Tommy, at 1 0 this afternoon, Josh Casey had a really good chance, Gomez had a really good chance. If either of those goes in, do we run out comfortable winners today? I think we do. Um, <clears throat> if they go in, um, I think we put the game's dead, buried. Um, we, I thought we managed the game very well today, I thought we were in control, um, and, and we didn't look like losing the game. Um, and obviously, we're all disappointed and hurting that we, we didn't come away with three points today. Were you disappointed with the, the manner of the goals that we conceded as well, defensively wise? Um, yeah, I mean, it's an area that we've, we've, we've been very strong in and we look comfortable again today. Um, and uh, <clears throat> to be honest, it was, a, it was two goals that were, were, for, were from long balls forward, to be honest, um, and which we normally deal with quite well. Um, but yeah, um, very disappointed uh, to obviously come away with, with nothing today. And uh, I thought man for man, the boys worked tremendously hard. Uh, there was a lot of work right there. Um, <clears throat> and obviously created chances. And uh, we'll probably play worse than that this season and, and win games. So disappointed, but um, obviously it was a strong performance from us. And uh, on another day, with a little bit of rubber to green, we, we come away with three points. In terms of the, the reaction from the players, you were obviously disappointed last week and results of late hasn't, haven't been great. You didn't get the right result today, but you must have been impressed with, with the boys' attitude to today's game and the way they played. Yeah, I mean, we had a good chat after the Enfield game. Um, <clears throat> and I said to him before the game today, you know, it was the week. We, we've, we've had two training sessions, um, trained very well. Um, the spirit in the camp has, has, has been good. And um, we took that onto the pitch today. And uh, as we say, we you know everyone saw the performance and the, and the work rate that was put in, and uh, you know disappointed not to, to come away with away with the three points. But you know we're going to have to take the positives out of um, the performance today. Um, and like you just said, you know those those chances if if they go in, um, then then we're, we're we're talking differently now. Um, but the way things are at the moment, you know sides get chances against us and and end up taking them and. And that's the fine lines in football, and it's small margins. And um, you know, we we we'll be remaining positive and um, looking at the week ahead. Obviously, uh, Surrey Senior Cup Tuesday in Leverett, and you know, as I said, we'll take the positives from from today and and uh, look to bounce back this week. One positive from today, in my opinion, was seeing Josh Casey in midfield. Um, is that where you see his his best role? Is that where he prefers to play rather than left back? Um, yeah, I mean, it's something that we've been um, speaking speaking about for a while. Um, Everybody knows probably his performances this year at left back as um, you know he's been our you know probably our best best player this season. You know his performances have been spot on and uh, but we thought we we uh, he could affect the game a little bit more going forward. Um, I thought Ryan Blake came in and done very well at left back and uh, I, I was pleased with Josh and obviously I was just speaking to him then he's he's very disappointed that he didn't take that chance. I mean it was a one on one that. Um, you know, he knows he should have scored, but um, <clears throat> it wasn't meant to be. And um, we, we, as I say, we need to remain positive and, and bounce back this week. At 1 0, were you tempted to make a tactical change from the bench, throwing him in for a swing? He wasn't around today, but Kavanaugh was on the bench to sort of bolster the midfield at 1 0? <clears throat> well, we, we, we did speak about that, but to be honest, uh, like I said, you know, we, we were managing the game very well. We looked in control. I thought the front two. Um, Worked tremendously hard. Um, you know, Pico Gomez was was dropping in um, and picking up things in, in that midfield area. Anyway, um, we didn't feel that we needed to um, invite any pressure by, by taking off a front man. Um, and as I say, we looked in control. We, our, our decision making was very good. Um, you know, we, as I say, we managed the game very well, and, and uh, I, I didn't feel it was needed for that. Um, but. A little bit unlucky, um, you know. As I say, didn't get the rubber to green today. But um, you know, the harder you work, the luckier you get, and uh, that's what we'll, we'll be doing. As long as the work rate was there, which it was, um, then uh, the results will come. We ran into Junior Cardi after the game just before we came up to see you, and he said that it looked today as though it was two sides who should be battling out in a playoff place. Um, obviously, yeah, being, being kind towards us, but I think that that's a fair reflection, isn't it? We do look like a top five side when we play like that. We do, we do, um, <clears throat> and listen. I know, you know, people get frustrated um, with results. I'm, I'm, I'm no different, you know. Um, we, 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 we're trying to get that um, right system 
Um, we're trying to change the way the lads have played from from, from previous years, and uh, we're trying to um, obviously get that right blend. Um, and you know, we had a relatively successful start to the season. We've hit a bit of a sticky patch in terms of our results, um, but you know, as long as we're um, remaining positive and we're looking. Um, like we're getting, things will change, um, and, and today certainly showed that in, with, with our performance. Then um, I've got no reason why we, we can't be looking in that playoff mix at the end of the season. The, the league's tight as it is, you know. A few wins, bounce backs, um, changes everything. You know, we bounce back with that, um, and it, we, we've certainly got the um, personnel and, and the group to um, certainly go on a go on a free game on beat and run, which obviously gets gets us in, into that. that that playoff berth, so you know we're we're, we're okay at the moment. Um, we we we'll, um, we'll work hard this week, um, and obviously um, take the positives from today. No, absolutely, yeah, stay positive. Yeah, good luck for the week. Thanks again for your time. Thanks, Thanks very much. Cheers.